Quite a few celebrities have tried their hand at making art, Miley Cyrus, James Franco, Shia LaBeouf, just to name a few. Miley Cyrus's show Dirty Hippie has been described as a drug-induced creation, not far from what you would expect. A five-foot towering bong covered with brightly colored lays, rave candies, weed, and beads. James Franco has showed a number of his drawings and paintings, as well as a collection of photographs based on the work of Cindy Sherman and his latest series of paintings called Fat Squirrel. Shia LaBeouf had a performance piece called Hashtag I Am Sorry, where he collaborated with British artist Luke Turner and Finnish artist Nastya Sadranko with a paper bag over his head that said, I am not famous anymore. For five days, members of the public were able to line up and sit in the room with him with a prop of their choice. Macaulay Culkin, Jay-Z, Ringo Starr, the list goes on and each time there's a ton of buzz and a lot of times the reaction is pretty split. That's not art, they're just trying to make money, what a joke, and perhaps most interesting to me is that we're only looking at this because they're celebrities. People are quick to jump in with their two cents and it's really easy these days with social media playing such a huge role in this sort of PR burst. People who normally might not talk about art but are always interested in celebrity gossip might chime in. The intermingling of celebrities in the art world is nothing new. They're still in that same artistic sphere and the art world has always run with the richest crowd, right? Having a big name gets you far and rolls in the big bucks. It's really straightforward. Galleries want to make money and having ties to a big name gets rich people to open their wallets and having celebrities headline shows, it's a natural choice. I don't blame galleries for this practice. There's a lot of talk about people saying that these guys should stop making art, they're making horrible things. I don't think that's true. I think it's great that they're making art. Art is therapeutic and cathartic and creative. I think it's a great message if they're investing their precious time into making art. I think there's a lot of benefits to making art and I'm not going to discourage anyone. There's no negative side effects to it, aside from people being annoyed at some story. Anyone who has the motivation to produce art and invest their time in it, I think that is already a very impressive feat and I commend them for it. Now that doesn't make their work good art and that doesn't mean that they're any more deserving or that they earned having a show in a gallery or all the buzz that they're generating but they get the show because they're famous. And is that fair? Probably not. Now a whole another issue to talk about is why are they making art? Now reasons can vary from as simple as I just feel like doing it and I enjoy doing it. I think that's great. But it can also be a marketing ploy, um, a way to generate buzz. Maybe they think it's an easy way to get some money. Personally, I really hope that they're being genuine and it's not just some team or someone just behind the scenes telling them, oh, this is your persona, you should just make this. That would be really disappointing. If these guys are sincere about creating art, I hope they really focus on what a big impact their name can have. They can sell or auction off their work and raise a lot of money for charities to help fund uh, programs for underserved youth, art therapy, art teaching programs. There's a lot of good that they can do. In the end, I think these shows and performances generate a lot of conversations that we may not have otherwise and engages people who might not necessarily even have a second thought about art to talk about art. And I think that's awesome. So what do you think? Have you seen any of the work of these celebrity instant artists? And what do you think of their work? I'd love to hear in the comments section below. If you enjoyed this video, please thumbs up and share with your friends. Please subscribe if you haven't. Thanks so much for watching. I'll see you guys next time.